light in the darkest room draws all attention to itself, away from the darkness, no matter how small the light is, light attracts. JT and Maggie, your love has attracted the life and the joy and the energy of everyone here and so many others. But most importantly, it's attracted the two of you. The light that each of you has for each other indeed has attracted you. JT, can you believe the day is finally here? Maggie, while it seems like we've been planning for ages, it still feels so surreal. I can believe that our love and happiness will only grow from here, and that thought makes my heart flutter. I can't believe the day we've been planning for and waiting for and talking about for so long is going to come and go in an instant. But the fact that we'll be married at the end of the day is the absolute best. When I sat down to write this letter, it was honestly very difficult to decide what to write. Not because I don't know what to say, but because there is so much that I want to. Today, we take the next step in our journey together. We will tell our future children stories from this day. Enjoy it, take everything in, and know that I love you more than you can ever imagine. I can't wait to stand by your side in a few short hours. I love you to infinity and beyond. JT and Maggie, a great joy that surrounds this celebration. That joy is rooted in the life and the love of all those who are here today, and the life and love of all those who could not be here, and all of those who have gone before us. As I sit down to write this, I don't even know where to begin, and I can't imagine my life without you in it, and I know now that I will never have to again. I love you more than you can imagine, and I'm so thrilled to be able to spend the rest of our lives together. It's incredible to think that at 18, I already met my future husband, and even though I knew that, I don't think I quite realized it. I can remember imagining a life with you all those years ago when we first started dating. I would think about this day, the day of our wedding. I would imagine our future children and you as a mother. I would daydream about the family vacations we would take with our families. Now all of those are becoming a reality and I couldn't be more perfect. I'm elated that we've already spent almost seven years of our lives together and I'm excited for what comes next. Travel, kids, grandkids, holidays and more. I can't wait to grow old with you and build our lives together as one. Not only do I love you more than anything, but I admire you as a strong, independent woman. Don't ever change for me. JT, you've reached into the depths of my heart and I truly can't imagine life without you. You fill me with joy, happiness, and love. I can't wait to be your wife. I love you, I love you more, I love you most. I will love you always. Since it is your intention to enter the covenant of holy matrimony, I ask that you now face each other, join your hands, and declare your consent before God and his church. I, John, take you, Margaret, to be my wife. I, Margaret, take you, John, to be my husband. I promise to be faithful to you. In good times and in bad. In sickness and in health. To love you and to honor you all, all the, the days, days of my, my life. life. What God joins together, no one may put asunder.
Maggie, take this ring. John, take this ring as a sign of my love and fidelity. In the name of the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit. Our wish for both of you today, JT and Maggie, is that the light and the joy and the happiness of this day will surround your souls, will surround your spirit, will surround your life now and forever. Thank you all for being here with us tonight and celebrating our marriage. Um, we're happy to have all of you here. Needless to say, joy like this in one's life is magnified when it's shared by the people you love. Maggie, you looked absolutely beautiful in that newborn nursery, and you blossomed into this absolutely gorgeous woman that we see before us today. It seemed there was not enough hours in the day to do everything you were so passionate about. You excelled at everything and developed into a very empowered young woman. JT, I hope you took debate in high school because you'll need some special skills to win some arguments at home. JT and Maggie are true examples of unconditional love. I've never seen someone look at their significant other the way JT looks at Maggie. The way my brother treats Maggie inspires me. The respect and extensive care he gives to her is what truly defines him as a husband. Maggie's selflessness and the way she makes my brother the best version of himself is what truly defines her as a wife. The most important accomplishment occurred your freshman year on the second floor of your College Avenue residency dorm where you met a special guy, a man named JT. I've been lucky to witness Maggie and JT's love grow. During college, JT would occasionally visit, and I'd get to know the boy that stole Maggie's heart. JT and Maggie are perfect for each other in many ways, because they're loyal, they're silly, they are each other's biggest cheerleaders, and above all else, they love fiercely. Wherever life leads, surround yourselves with love and joy. Work hard like you always have, and turn your hopes and dreams into reality. Practice patience, tolerance, and forgiveness with each other, and you'll have a long, successful marriage. And then, when you celebrate your anniversary 25 years from now, and reflect about today, it will be difficult to imagine that your love for each other could possibly be stronger than it is at this moment. 